Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm making the Cremora tart, which is a French tart and very similar to the French cheesecake. So let's start making our tart. So first we're going to prep our base for the Cremora tart. I'm using a casserole glass dish, which I've basically sprayed with spray and cook. And I'm using my mini chopper and I'm using tennis biscuits but you could use digestive biscuits or ginger biscuits this is 200 grams I'm just going to add this in here And we're just going to chop this until So it's at a good consistency. I've got a hundred grams of melted butter that I'm adding in here. Just gonna mix this together. So this is what it looks like. Now we're gonna place it into our greased casserole just getting everything in here and just gonna even this out Just going to use my measuring cup to press down to make sure this is compacted. So I'm just going to place this into my fridge to set for about an hour. I'm using a stand mixer and I'm using one can of condensed milk. Just going to add this in here. And then I need a half a cup of fresh lemon juice. So I have a half cup of freshly squeezed lemon juice. This was three lemons, but be accurate, let it be half a cup. You don't want to go by three lemons, and then sometimes it's less or more, and we're just gonna blend this together. So I'm just going to be adding two cups of Cremora milk powder. Just 
and one cup of water so I'm adding one cup of water to this and I'm going to give that a mix we're just combining the two ingredients Now we're ready to add this to our condensed milk and lemon juice. So I'm just adding the Cremora, the water, to our lemon juice and condensed milk and I'm going to give this a good beating. So our mixture is now ready and you can see it's nice and smooth and we're going to add this to our biscuit base. So our biscuit base is now set and we're just going to add our mixture over and level this and let this set in the fridge until it's nice and firm. You could decorate with fresh cream, fresh whipped cream or some lemon curd or some granite de la pal. it's really up to you so this is now going in the fridge so our Cremora tart is now set so I'm going to top with some granite de la pal and I'm just spreading this over just to give it a bit of that tang and cut down a bit of the sourness from the lemon that acidic taste but as I said you could use lemon curd or whipped fresh cream So I'm going to put this back in the fridge and it is ready to serve but it's best served chilled. Guys thanks for watching today and I hope you're going to give this a try. Until our next video take care bye.